Hey YouTube, it's Big MJ44 here, showing you how to jailbreak 5.1.1 with one of the easiest programs to use. First one you want to use is Tiny Umbrella to save your SHSH files in case you accidentally mess up, which is pretty hard to do, but you have a backup there, and it's best to save all your SHSHs anyways when it have updates you want to downgrade or whatever. Have a IS. IPSW for iPod 3 also to start fresh and then use abstinence which use the latest version which updates which allows you to do for iPod 4S iPhone 3 all those anyways so let's get started pretty much the program runs it itself you don't have to do the DFU mode or any of that other stuff and what you want to do is you want to plug it into your system it'll read it and you'll be able to just click jailbreak and it'll pretty much from there do all the work by itself I'm gonna play real-time mode I'm not gonna skip like all the other videos which makes it hard so you could see exactly how it is done on time Right now it's doing nothing. It's loading it up. And then it's gonna show restore in progress. That's where it's loading all the files. It'll turn off, don't worry, it's normal. It'll reboot itself. Just let it go through the process of rebooting and updating jailbreak files and installing Cydia. And even though it finished there and re rebooted, let it finish here before messing with it. Special thanks to the Chronic Dev team for allowing untethered jailbreaks. Alright, and it finally finished. Now, turn it on. And there you go, Cydia. You don't have to worry about the whole holding DFU modes and other stuff like that. Cydia will upload by itself. You basically let your system do all the work for you. And enjoy.